Hi everybody, it's Jason from Rangeland RV. I'm here in Salt Lake City at the very first annual RVX event and I'm super excited because I've been waiting for this one. Um, this is the unveiling of the all new RPOD 195. For the last couple of months, RPOD enthusiasts have seen uh, some press release stuff really just drawings a couple photographs this is actually the first prototype of the unit and we're getting to stand here lots of different changes we'll go through some of the similar features and some of the changes as well so first of all seven feet wide that's the most significant change and it's allowed them to do a lot of different things it's only 3400 pounds so keeping with our pods ultralight tradition uh, this unit is still super SUV towable by tons of different things they use the torsion axle system uh, to give it that nice smooth ride and protect that unit from any road vibrations or road shock uh, another big change is although we're aluminum sidewalls and all laminated coach they have went to a rubber roof membrane on this coach so flatten out the roof and went with a rubber roof membrane. They've now went with the full domatic awning. So awning arms, uh, awning comes out about nine and a half feet, has the LED light strip in the tube. And then we'll walk around the back here and show you a couple of features because there's a lot of RPOD firsts. Here's one of your RPOD firsts is a rear ladder, walkable roof. RPOD has always had a walkable roof, but this one has more roof to walk on. Um, your wall slide, your torsion axle and this is super significant as well um, is that they offer now a full pass-through storage because when we go inside this unit you're gonna see that it has a walk around queen bed um, same tank sizes so we have 30 gallon uh, gray tank 30 gallon black water tank and 36 gallons of fresh water onboard capacity so again leading the industry uh, one thing that was really exciting was uh, the opening of this event, uh, this unit was selected um, as one of the most new innovative products for the 2019-2020 model years. And show you one of the other small features here. This outdoor kitchen, which pulls out, uh, it tucks inside the pasture storage, pulls out completely to be left at home, stowed in the back of the truck. Uh, to utilize more pasture storage. So really cool concept with your outdoor spray port, two burner stove, sink basin. Let's go inside. You're gonna see a ton of huge changes. It's really exciting. So we have our, our pet dishes and our leash latch on the back of the unit. So um, our pod and their division has went to a really pet friendly product. They really want people to know to bring their pets camping with them. We went to a six cubic foot stainless steel refrigerator with your freezer over top. Um, and I think our pod enthusiasts are gonna just love that as well. They get a big, big fridge. Uh, you, they've done an amazing job with the kitchen. So I'll just pan down here. So we have three drawers. We have another drawer up top, lots of cabinetry, huge stainless steel sink basin, a two burner recess stove, and our pod put beautiful building materials into their coach so you're able to recess everything and have the most available counter space possible convection oven which if you look at some videos that we've put out actually works i love this huge big back window looks amazing and then massive pantry so this floor plan kind of like the 179 the fridge would have been there in the past now we move the fridge because we have a wider space to work with and left that as all available storage. You'll see that same slide out U-shaped dinette, overhead cabinets, and the most significant change is the first ever R-Pod with a walk around queen bed. So here we have cabinets, wardrobes on both sides. So his and hers, um, your entertainment area over on the back wall here backs onto the bathroom um, some really neat features I love this wireless cell phone charger just lay your Android phone on top of that and it starts to charge that may or may not make it into full production because we again we are in proto one and then they've done this amazing job so we've all seen the 189 and 190s bathrooms 
uh, which have went to a dry bath. And here we have a full three-piece dry bath. So nice big stand-up shower, medicine cabinet sink, extra storage, your toilet, fantastic fan. So I'm just gonna do a detailed walk around with the camera here. Um, so this unit is finally in production. Uh, I've heard that the Hood River Edition units are going to be built uh, first, or we're going to start to see them first. So I'm really excited. We put in some orders at Rangeland RV. So if you guys are interested in coming down and seeing one or learning a bit more, uh, discussing some pricing or availability, please do give us a call. Um, check us out at rangelandrv.com. And if you want to see more videos, please like our videos, subscribe to our channel. We try and post stuff regularly. And as the weather gets nicer, we're going to be sending out tons of videos. So really excited Salt Lake City, Utah for the RVX event and the first ever view of the RPOD 195 seven foot wide trailer.